Natalie here for University TV and today we're touring beautiful Lafayette College. Founded in 1826 by the residents of Easton, Pennsylvania and named for the Revolutionary War hero, Marquis de Lafayette. His family motto, Cur Non, means why not and is a rallying cry at Lafayette. Alright, let's check out what Lafayette College has to offer. Why not? Lafayette is located in Easton, Pennsylvania, which is a little over an hour from both New York City and Philadelphia. More than 20 buses run from Easton to New York and back every day. Lafayette College features 69 modern and historic buildings on 340 total acres, including a 230-acre athletics campus. Lafayette enrolls approximately 2,400 students, with a population of 53% male and 47% female, from 42 U.S. states and territories and 47 countries. Students of color from the U.S. and abroad make up about 25% of the student body. Lafayette helps me connect with the local culture, with the U.S. Uh, lifestyle, by introducing me to a host family. And my host family actually introduced, um, invites me over for Thanksgiving dinner, for a Christmas party, and I find that very heartwarming. All the experiences you need are built into your four years here. Lafayette has one of the highest percentages of any college or university of students working with faculty on research. By their senior year, half of the students have done so, and more than half of Lafayette students study abroad. Lafayette requires that students applying for admission submit either the SAT or ACT. If taking the ACT, the writing section is required. Tuition and fees at Lafayette, including room and board, run about $57,000 per year. Need-based grants, merit scholarships, loans, and work-study are all available to students. 51 areas of study over four divisions, including humanities, natural sciences, social sciences, and engineering await students at Lafayette. Or you can work with professors to design your own major. A lot of my students are double majors, and they're double majors in things like art and neuroscience or art and engineering. And these are things that we don't often think about as being uh, connected, but these students are finding ways of not just being uh, interdisciplinary, but I almost call it transdisciplinary, that they're trying to find a new language that houses the languages of both of the things that they're interested in. Innovative thinking across academic boundaries defines a Lafayette education. Professors here challenge you to cross-train your brain. Yeah, try this. Music and neuroscience. Why not? With a $750 million endowment um, at a school our size, our endowment spending per student is massive. And compared to our peer colleges, compared to some of the best universities and colleges out there, uh, we are very favorable in what we're spending on each student experience here. So it creates very intimate settings for classes, for labs. It creates huge opportunities for our students to step abroad and take their life and learning um, beyond and well beyond our backyard here in Easton, Pennsylvania. I have students over to the house and I bake bread and we um, have uh, bread together at my house and I kind of uh, spread that out across the campus and I think that's something that's particular to a small campus, that uh, that kind of a sense of community and a sense of connectedness between um, the faculty members and the students, the distance between us doesn't seem quite as large. 23 Lafayette Leopard men's and women's athletic teams compete at the NCAA Division I level in the Patriot League. Did you know that the Lafayette-Lehigh rivalry is college football's most played rivalry? In fact, the 150th game takes place at the Yankee Stadium. The atmosphere that we get at games here is absolutely incredible. You know, the students here are incredible. Uh, this past year we had something co open up called the Leopards Lair, which is our student section here. Um, they come to every game, football, basketball, soccer, whatever, and they come, you know, in full force, always rocking, you know, ready to go. With over 70 residential facilities, housing on campus is guaranteed for all four years. Students can choose among many different living options, including traditional residence halls, suites, group living units, and living learning communities. The college also has four fraternities and six sororities. The dorm I had freshman year was amazing. Like the room was huge, it overlooked Easton. Um, it was just like a great, just a great spot. 
Looking for stuff to do after classes? Lafayette students have more than 250 groups, clubs, and sports to choose from. On campus is actually another organization I'm involved with. It's called LAF. LAF is the Lafayette Activities Forum, and it's what plans all of our spring concerts and on-campus events. Um, they plan Time Flies and Aquamore this year, and the Lumineers came for Fall Fest, which is pretty awesome. Um, so we had some three huge artists come to such a small school. Um, Time Flies actually included clips from our concert in his newest music video. Tony Blair was here in April. Jane Goodall was here in April. Um, Jimmy Carter was also here. In a three-week span, you had these world leaders who came to engage, challenge, and excite and inspire our students. You may be interested to learn that over 94% of Lafayette students are employed or in top grad schools and internships within six months of graduation. Uh, but students who are interested in working in industry have opportunities with our alumni. There is an excellent, well-established alumni network um, through Lafayette. Students can go to career services, sign up for the Gateway program in their summer uh, before enrolling at Lafayette and spend four years really cultivating um, their resume for the right opportunities to present themselves with uh, a job, an internship, um, upon graduation. Students say Lafayette is a special place because of the distinctive combination of the liberal arts and engineering and the opportunities it provides for student faculty research across multiple disciplines to solve real world problems. As the Marquis de Lafayette would say, Kernon. So why not come to Lafayette? Anything is possible here. The world is your campus. Wow, there's really a lot going on here at Lafayette College. And I hope you guys enjoyed the tour with me. For University TV, I'm Natalie, and I'll see you guys later.